Alrighty, greetings YouTube. I'm here doing doing some network testing in the great state of Florida, in the city of Orlando. And I wanna be able to show y'all what the networks look like for on my trip here. And what we have on deck right now is AT&T is on the right, Verizon is on the left. Verizon is showing band 66, 20 megahertz. I think they have NR for millimeter wave, but it's not showing just yet. And then AT&T is carry aggregating in five with in band 66, 10 megahertz. But we gotta hit it with a speed test to actually find out. So, as you can see, we're in the city of Orlando. Smack dab in the middle of the city of, I think it was this town hall. So, first test is Google. much for them as it would if it was fully 100% deployed but they're only doing four carriers I'm surprised they're not doing N77 yet because they got their full deployment now from the satellite carriers both both carriers actually uh, AT&T should be able to access their N77 fully now also but Verizon is at five, 538 down and 94 up. And AT&T is 124 down and 42 up. Let's corroborate that with a speed testing app. percent hit for Verizon on millimeter wave. AT&T is not slouching, but they're not showing up also. I'll show you what the carrier aggregation looked like for both of them. Almost 100 upload. So Verizon at 1.7 gigs down and 99 up. AT&T at 154 down and 49 up. So, how snappy is these networks? Even though AT&T is not in the same ballpark with Verizon at this location. Go to ESPN.com. Verizon, the banner ad came in last. Go to NFL.com. The banner ad came in roughly about the same time for them. I think Verizon had the edge. Last one. Go to CNN.com. Verizon. Verizon got the edge on that one. Network wise, I see how they hold up directly against each other. Is who completes this task fastest, even though they're doing a speed test? And go.
So it is about speed, but it's about how fast to finish this task. Verizon capped out at 1.8 gigs and 113 upload on that test. They're both on the browser. AT&T is only a hair behind. At least a half a second. All right, so Verizon's already at the streaming. on the 720p AT&T just now getting to the 720p test and Verizon's on the 1080p so it's falling behind so that extra juice from millimeter wave is actually helping them so Verizon finished the test first we're at 1.8 gigs by 113 Browsing and streaming very good. 85% for browsing, 94% streaming. AT&T, 110 down and 57 up. 76% browsing. Could be better, but it's not that bad. And streaming very good at 95%. Even though it came out 95% better than Verizon, which is on millimeter wave. All right. So my own personal 4K test. Let's do a new video. We're gonna switch it to 4K. Here we go. Jump. Verizon. Verizon again. Verizon the third time. ATT was not that far behind. So don't let that fool you. For a millimeter wave is very powerful when you got it. So the last test is downloading directly over the network. Now, how efficiently do you get this done? Millimeter wave can't be overdone. So three, two, one, go. All right, 19 to 4% percent at and 22% to 9% percent at and Forty percent to twenty seven percent AT and T. Eighty four percent to fifty five Verizon and one hundred percent to sixty six uh, Verizon. So Verizon kicked in at the last moment for the millimeter wave. They were slouching for a second. All of a sudden they woke up. So both of them are not slouching, but Verizon looked better on this on this round of tests all right thank y'all for watching if you have any comments leave them in the comment below like share and subscribe so we can uh, see more videos from the great state of florida thank y'all and y'all have a good one